Hi, this is Ron Risman at Cambertown.com and I am here to show you a way to take the iPad, which you can see here, and actually output it to a TV set, but not just for movies. You can actually output it for everything. So you can actually see your entire springboard from the iPad right here, and it's also sensitive to auto rotation, so I can rotate it around and move it. So now you can give presentations, you can show applications. So if I want to show the weather app, the AccuWeather.com application, I can just bring it up on the screen here. And as you can see, you can display it on your screen. Now in order to do this with an iPad, you need to use the Spirit jailbreak for the iPad. It's a very, very simple jailbreak to run. Once you run the jailbreak application, you then install, or it'll install for you, an app called Cydia, which you see right down here on the bottom right. The Cydia application, and I'll let this load, uh, allows you to load in jailbroken applications. Now this jailbroken application is called Display Out. And uh, Display Out is an application that runs for, um, I think it's $1.99. And that's what I'm using here. I'm using a, the application called Display Out. And once you install it on your system, it actually shows up in the preference screen and it shows up right here under extensions and if I click on display out it brings me to uh, this preference section here where I can actually scale and zoom in on the screen itself or I can scale it zoom out to fit the screen and uh, I'm just going to run through some of the applications here that you can actually use uh, any application on your iPad you can actually use to output to a TV set so right now I'm in a program called Mask which is a image editing program for the iPad. I'm going to turn it sideways here so we can fill more of the screen. And, uh, and I'm going to run basically a filter on here. So I'm going to turn this into black and white. And as you can see here, I've already got part of my filter done. So I'm going to go through and I'm going to paint in a little bit more color just on the deer itself. And I'm going to go to a smaller brush. And then with a the smaller brush size, I'm going to go through and I'm going to paint out some of the spill that I got into the grass. And let's get some of the spill over here. So as you can see, I can actually demo products now. I can demo applications and I can hook it up to a projector or hook it up to a, an external monitor depending on the type of cable you have. Right now I'm using a composite cable. So I'm going into this TV via composite cable. You can also get a VGA cable so you can hook it up to a projector or a regular monitor, computer monitor. But it is a, a great way to demo applications and Apple does not provide this capability in the iPad. So somebody has written an application that you have to use on a jailbroken, jailbroken iPad to get this application uh, to do this. But uh, it works uh, pretty amazing actually. And uh, if you want to surf the web, just give you some example of what web surfing would be like. I'm going to go to uh, let's see the Boston Globe, the big picture. And this is the big picture website from the bostonglobe.com showing you uh, large, large pictures. And you can zoom in, pinch and zoom. It's very, very responsive. If you can see my screen here, it, uh, it really is a virtually no shutter lag at all. When I scroll through here. So this is called Display Out. It's $1.99 for jailbroken iPads. If you want to jailbreak your iPad, you download a program called Spirit. You probably want to make sure you back up your iPad in case you want to restore it uh, with a future firmware update from Apple because most likely they'll patch the, uh, the crack or the, the uh, software tool that they're using to jailbreak these. They'll probably patch it. Um, but you don't have to update to the newest version of the software when they come out with it. You can keep your jailbroken iPad just as is and uh, enjoy the experience of sharing the internet with uh, everybody, on, everybody else in the house or with an audience. And that's it. This is Rod Risman at Cameratown.com. Thank you very much.